Oh, hey, I'm just chilling. It is Sunday, not sure if you can see that. It is the day after the show day. I will tell you this, I look way better right now. It is the day after. I just took my last transformation pictures and my weigh-ins. And guys, I'm so freaking happy that is over. 90 days, I can now relax because that takes like 5 to 10 minutes of every single morning. I can't change. I need to take the pictures first and then start my day. It is Sunday today and I will just film my day and I'm, I feel way leaner now than I did yesterday and that is messed up. I already sent my video so here is my shape the day after. I did not have a lot of water, I didn't have a lot of food. You saw yesterday what I ate and that was everything so of course I will be leaner, I will look leaner. The amount of calories that I've consumed were not a lot. So this is my physique after and you can see I am really lean, really lean right now. Back pose. There we go. I, it's almost paper skin. It is not like show ready, but this is like summer ready. This is beach ready. This beach body. You can see I'm dry as hell. You can see the abs underneath it. The veins are coming out. So I'm looking way leaner than yesterday. That is really messed up. I will tell you that. I should have sent this video to him. <laughs> Just look at the skin, at the skin. So let's see the weight of this morning. Here we go, the bathroom as always. Yesterday was 80.5 and today, of course, the end of the cup. You know what my goal was. I need to end it well on 79.6 below 80 kilograms. Here's my shape in the mirror, the legs, should have shaven my legs, but it is all good, my shape. Let's just start the day. So that is my shape so far, and this is like the leanest I've been in a long, long time. And I will reverse up, but this is probably the last time you will see me this lean, because I'm just gonna enjoy my day today, and the next week I'm not gonna film, I'm just gonna enjoy and relax. And if you have any suggestions for series, please let me know. I might do a reverse up series with weekly cheats, exactly what I did last year. And today I'm not gonna come, I'm just gonna enjoy my day. And I'm just gonna bring you with me. Shall we start today? Oh yeah, I'm just chilling right here outside. I just made my intro, guys. I had no idea what to film. My brother was outside, so I thought, Help me, help me make the intro. Just enjoying my day. The sun is out. I am out. The shirt is off. Had to make the intro, so thought I'm gonna eat it as well. I'm not gonna go cheat, but it's gonna be a non-counting day. So my mom made like this fresh homemade bread yesterday. A really big bread. So I will have like a big slice of this with three whole eggs, some turkey, bacon, turkey meat, sorry, and some low fat cheese. I'm gonna make healthy choices by using like this pan spray instead of oil. Don't go and put like stuff that you don't need on the food. Like this, just using pan instead instead of oil or anything else. But I'm gonna do just one whole egg and two egg whites. That is also like some healthy choices that you can make. You don't need three egg yolks. Guys, three egg yolks is like 10 grams of fat. That is, that is again like 100 calories. So if you can save the calories, save it. Have a cookie or something. Don't break the yolk. Don't break the yolk. Just gonna slice a really big piece of the bread and put the eggs on there. Homemade bread my mom made. So tasty. If you want the perfect yolk, never turn it around. Just cover it with a lid. So I decided to go with two slices of bread and I'm gonna spread this low fat cheese on there. If you can choose low fat, please do and just spread it on there. So I'm gonna put some ketchup and mayonnaise. Again, this is sugar reduced and a fat reduced mayonnaise. Just a little bit on there. And I will have this piri piri medium hot sauce from Nando's. A little bit on there and top it off. Put my egg on there. Breakfast served. True, how simple but yet tasty does this look? Oh yeah. If you want to maintain this physique, if you want to maintain the abs and this leanness, 
You're gonna do hours of cardio, you're gonna do low carbs, because that is what, ha what you have been doing right now. And if you add some calories, don't do cardio, you will gain weight. Don't be scared to gain fat, gain weight. If you can look like this right now, I bet you you can do that the next time. So if you can do it once, you can do it twice, three, four times. Instead of having normal ketchup, have reduced sugar ketchup. Instead of having high fat cheese, have low fat cheese. All those things will add up. Let's say I saved here two to three hundred calories. Do that times five. Five meals in a day, save three hundred calories. That is fifteen hundred calories in one day. Fifteen hundred calories just by doing those small things and you won't really taste a difference, a big difference. So a non-counting but somewhat healthier cheat today. So Mm. The other calories, unlimited calories, and um, just gonna enjoy this, just gonna enjoy my day. Mm. Having my supplements, two fish oil, one multivitamin, standard thing. Also, I will have just my normal water intake. I'm not gonna increase it by like three to four liters. It is 12:30. I finished my breakfast like two hours ago. I feel amazing. So, as you know, my birthday was on 25th of May, and I got one of the best presents on my birthday. So I haven't really shown you this, but I've got a whole bag of monsters. I have here exactly 10 monsters and I got one chocolate Toblerone bar. So this is by far my favorite present ever and you know what I crave not right now? One monster. Ice cold. Opening a new monster. This is a smaller one, but Delicious. Just having a relaxed day. Just enjoying my day right now at the moment. 90 days are over. So it is now 2.30 in the kitchen. I'm gonna make my second meal. I'm getting somewhat hungry. So I'm gonna have a lot of chicken and I'm gonna make a delicious sauce. So I'm craving this like cheesy sauce. And the basic sauce, everybody almost knows this, is besiamela. Use some milk, butter, some flour, and some cheese, and make a really basic cheesy sauce. Add that to the noodles, and bake my chicken. I'm craving some noodle alfredo chicken. So here we go, I will use some olive oil. I'm not gonna count it, not gonna measure it. This will be for the chicken. The water is already boiling, I will have the whole bag of this noodles. Just put it in there, pour it like that. And I've got my chicken marinated in some paprika, garlic, and just pepper. And just bake the chicken. So here we go, gonna turn on around the chicken. I totally forgot something. Of course, gotta cook without a shirt on. So if you put a wooden spoon in the middle like that, it won't spill. So I've got my chicken. I need to turn it around. Oh, that sound, that sound though. Woo. Just look at that beauty. And while I'm cooking, I'm gonna snack on some Doritos chips, garlic. I saw this bowl on the table and I thought, why not? I'm gonna drain the noodles. You don't wanna cook them completely through because the sauce will be hot and the sauce will cook the noodles even further through. So get some cold water and rinse your noodles. Then just take your saucepan, then put it back with some ex with some excess water. Just turn it off and put it back on the heat like that and let it sit. Now I'm gonna make the sauce. Have a big knob of butter, put it in the pan. Let that melt. So when the butter is melted, just a little bit of flour. Not too much, and just gonna stir it around until you get a really like clumpy <laughs> mixture. I'm gonna add some milk to this, combine that all. It is getting thicker and thicker, I will tell you that. And you can see some bubbles, so the flour is working, it is like bin binding with it, and it's getting thicker and thicker. You don't wanna overcook it. Add a bit of pepper, nutmeg. Add a bit of nutmeg to that. This will be a delicious sauce for on the noodles really cre creamy and really nice from texture and what you want to do to make it even creamier add some cheese I'm gonna add some cheese and mix that around the pan is still hot so the cheese will melt in the sauce so I didn't add salt because 
the cheese is already salty. Here we go, just take my noodles, plate it, however you want it. Now take this masterpiece, delicious chicken breast, one more piece, why not? And now, just gonna pour the sauce all over the chicken. Damn. To finish it off, some parsley for the color. Such a simple but yet delicious meal. This is not a healthy meal, this is a really high calorie meal. So I added the cheese, I added butter, I added flour. This is just a beauty. It's just a beauty. Let's cut open the chicken, shall we? Oh, that is such a beauty. Damn. Girl, damn girl. Just experiment with stuff. Cooking is so easy. I'm just curious to the cheesy sauce. Mm. I'm done. I'm done with the noodles right there. This is the shot. Mm. Warm noodles with chicken. Mm. Take the chicken, the noodles, dip it in some cheesy sauce and just... Mm. Bellissimo! The creamy cheesy sauce with the chicken breast. Gotta enjoy this. <laughs> Here we go, the last bite of this delicious, delicious meal. Mm. Please like the video right now and I might do more of these just once a week. Just have a non-counting day and eat whatever and cook for you guys. Yes, I will gain some weight from this day, but I don't really care that much. Tomorrow I might do some cardio. I'm gonna be back on the grind. I have to work, so I already prepared my meal. Some cottage cheese, green beans and egg whites. And here I have some broccoli, chicken and some low-fat cheese. And I'm now making my dinner for tonight, so I will have cauliflower rice so I'm gonna fry up some rice and, and here it is here we go I've got my meal it is all all done so I've got my cauliflower rice with some low-fat cheese and some parsley on top I will add some low-fat mayonnaise and I will have one can of Pepsi Max oh yeah Pepsi Max Mm, mm, mm. Here are the calories and macros for this meal. Unlimited calories. So guys, I can't just have plain cauliflower rice. There's no protein, there are no carbs. So because it is a non-counting day, I will have another plate. The second plate. So my mom made these like corn muffins, cornbread muffins. I will have some be I will have some beans and this is like turkey and chicken deli meat for some protein so this will be the total meal cornbread but in muffin cake forms so this is freaking tasty mmm the taste is just like mmm it has some sugar in it so it is somewhat sweet somewhat savory so freaking delicious and I have your kidney beans for some extra fiber and as always the texture on this is just the perfection make healthy and smart choices like the cheese the mayonnaise don't go with the cornbread, <laughs> but I was craving it, and tomorrow I will be back on the grind for a week, at least a week. I'm not gonna cheat. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Dip it in some cheese, in some cheese. Mm. Mm. Bellissimo. It is late at night, bedtime dessert. So, I've got here quark with one scoop of protein, some mango and some raspberries and here I have a cacao sludge just cacao powder with a bit of water and a sweetener and I have my protein cookie I'm gonna get back to FYM and just enjoying my life enjoying my time right here just gonna spread it on the cookie yogurt like this eat it mm. so I've got my cookie 
mm, somewhat reasonable. So I've got the mango with the raspberries, the quark, mm, refreshing. Mm. So if you like this video, please like the video and if you want to subscribe on my YouTube channel right there and also if you want to follow me on Instagram at Darko Bunich Games for days and guys I hope you have a great day, great night, whatever it is in life, do what you want, do it now, I dare you, live life, peace.